This video will cover adverbs, which you find in Hansen and Quinn's Greek and Intensive Course in section 64 on page 178. An adverb is a part of speech that tells how something happens or modifies adjectives or other adverbs. In English, our default way of forming them is with ly. So if we have an adjective just, all we have to do is add ly and we get the adverb justly. If we have the adjective bad, if we add ly, we get the adverb badly. Greek has something very, very similar. All we have to do is add os, omega, sigma. So if we want to form these same adverbs in Greek, we will get the nominative singular masculine form, and then we'll go to the genitive of that masculine singular, and we'll take off the ending, omicron, upsilon, u, and we'll add to that our new adverb ending, os, dikaios, justly. Let's do it for badly as well. So we get the masculine nominative singular, kakos, and then we see the genitive singular version, kaku, and then we replace that u ending with our new adverb ending, os. And then that will get a circumflex. If the accent is going to be over the last syllable, over the new ending os, it becomes a circumflex. Kakos means badly. And that's it. That is all you have to do to create adverbs from adjectives in Greek. There will be other ways to do it as well. In fact, we'll see how the neuter accusative singular of an adjective can simply be used as an adverb. But here is the regular ly type way to form adverbs in Greek. And I can't teach omega sigma adverbs in Greek without recommending to you Tom Lehrer's ly song for English. I'll have a link to it in the comments section with this video. But now you know how to do adverbs in Greek.